So it's day 42. It's the night before I start my chemo tomorrow and it's just been an absolutely huge last few days. Maddie was actually readmitted back to hospital last week and and actually on the Friday I was supposed to be going to have an echocardiogram and Maddie was sick as anything. There was talk of maybe her knee even needing to go back to Starship and at that stage I just said no, I'm not doing any chemo, I'm not doing anything, this is just all far too hard and Madeline is just for me just far more important right now and um, Actually, it was the nursing staff who actually kind of like grabbed me and shook me and slapped me around the face and said, come on, Sarah, get on with it. Maddie's fine with us. We know where you're going to be in the hospital. Go and do it. It's only going to take half an hour to do your, do your heart testing and stuff. Go do it. We'll look after Maddie, and if we need you, we can get hold of you really, really quickly. But it was just so damn hard to leave and to make that decision to just leave her. But I did and went and did it. And then so she spent the next... In fact, she's just been sick now for nearly 10 days straight, and I'm so pleased that today we've actually been able to come home from hospital so because she's been sick all these last few days, I haven't even had a chance to think about tomorrow or to even think, crikey, what am I doing? But I know that I did make the decision on Friday to have a pick line. So 9.30 tomorrow morning, I'm going in to have my pick line put in my arm. Um, I've had to breathe heavy about that because it's just done under a local and I'm such a wimp. So I'll do that at 9.30 and then I'll start my first chemo session at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So how do I feel? I don't know. Do you know what? I've just got so many things that I planned to do last week and haven't had a chance to do anything that... I don't know. 